My name is Greg Wallfield, and I'm the head baseball coach here at Oyster River High School. Uh, I've been coaching in the Seacoast area for 30 years. Um, quite, a few th quite a few of those years uh, were at a very large school with a very large amount of space. And one of the obvious things that I noticed when I first came here was the very limited amount of space that we had here at the high school. The baseball field was positioned in the incorrect position. All our outfielders uh, faced into the sun. Um, when we were playing a game on the baseball field, our athletic director was not able to schedule practices and or other games on about a third of our space that we had uh, due to safety reasons, foul balls and such. In those 30 years of coaching here in New England, um, one of these facilities is long, long, long overdue. Um, of course, the obvious reasons are the winter that we're going through right now. Especially as spring coaches, we don't get outside. Lacrosse has to work in the gym, baseball has to work in the gym, um, and to do what we have to do with those young men, fielding ground balls, uh, trying to throw, distances are shorter. Having a turf field opens up being able to get outdoors early, uh, being able to get out there when it starts to warm up a little bit. I mean, a turf field is uh, something that can be plowed all winter long, and once it does start to warm up, um, it's usable right away. One of the things a turf field does give us here at Oyster River, and what I've noticed in walking the fields, is um, a field that plays the same every single day. It's safe, there's not a lot of bumps and stuff in the field. Having a field, a turf field here at Oyster River High School, gives us a showcase facility. It's a facility that a lot of people will want to come see, want to come watch games at. Having a facility like this opens um, it up to the whole community, not just the kids playing, but the whole entire community. It opens up doors for the school to let other people use the facility.